go to admin section and in admin section you have to go to model loader install the package that you have got from the store just upload install Connect. all right so the package is installed you have to pass your key click on validate and once you get a success you have to click on please configure whatsapp setting so this is your whatsapp setting page you have to select twilio you have to get your sid token and number from your twilio account so log into your twilio and in the dashboard you can see uh, the account sid just copy and paste it here copy your token paste it here and last is your phone number so right now i am using my sandbox number for sending it out you can use your whatsapp number if you have activated with the twilio so we have the sandbox number that i'm going to copy here and paste it here remove the space So now setting is done. So we are good to go. We have to go to, okay, save this before uh, leaving the page. Go to your lead module or any module lead account or contact. Open the contact that you want to send a message. Okay, you will see this WhatsApp icon beside each phone number. And if I see the history section right now, I cannot see anything. It's completely blank. So now we have to send in WhatsApp message, but because I'm using the sandbox number, I have to initiate the chat from my mobile phone. So for that, I'll go to my phone. I'll write, I'll write on the text, the text which is mentioned over there, that is join form onto. So I'll write down the same from my phone, join form onto all right so the chat have been initiated now if i go back i have got a message here also that is message received now if i am going back to the crm sending a message from here so this is the chat box you can select your predefined template and send it from here okay now if i check all right so i got the address all right so i will now go refresh the same page and now i'll check the history section so there's one logged whatsapp message that is outbound hell and what is the message with all the details and everything so now we have to configure the next step that is for incoming so you have to set up the url in your uh, Twilio webhook URL. Okay, so for webhook URL, you have to go to the setting, WhatsApp sandbox setting, and pass the URL of your CRM index.php followed by entry point. The name of the entry point will be receive WhatsApp SMS and save it. So my inbound message configuration is done from the Twilio end. So I'll send now WhatsApp from my phone that is ps thanks all right so let's go back to the crm refresh this page okay so i have got all the notifications also over here uh, if i go down i can also check it from my history section that is there is one more message locked if i click on it it says oh yes thanks and it's inbound held so we have tested for the outbound and inbound with the sandbox number you can check it with your own number and you can configure it in the cm okay so there are a couple of more things that has to be uh, checked how to create the template which we are using for sending in a message so if i go to template and create email template we are using the same module so uh, 
let's say welcome message okay you have to check this uh, field as yes sms template select the module that you are going to use in so it's lead module okay and i am writing it here lead and lead and welcome on board all right and save it now if i go to my lead and if i want to send a message over here i have to select i, I will get the list so i have welcome message so dear benita singh welcome on board sent i got that message on my phone dear benita singh welcome on board so this was one thing the other thing was the mass sms uh, mass whatsapp we can send from the list view so just select the list click on mass whatsapp and here also you can select a template so for that what we will be doing is we'll create one generic template that is welcome message generic okay so when we are using any generic we also have to use a we don't have to use any variable basically it will be not dear any name it will be dear customer because it's common for all so you can use that template from bb mass whatsapp and start sending a mass whatsapp from the mess from crm thank you so much